The line has been out the door all morning here at Framingham High School, where an expected 12,000 Brazilians will show up and vote to elect a new president, even miles away from home. What brought you here today? Well, I wanted to come out and see what the turnout was going to be. I'm very impressed by all of the Brazilian people coming out to take part in their presidential election. Obviously, it shows that they cherish the right to vote. Do you think it matters whether you're legal or illegal to vote for your, for your country? The illegal issue being in the United States is an issue. It's against the law. But I'm not here to point the fingers because if you look across all of these people, I can't tell you who's legal or who's not. They're exercising their right or their mandatory right to vote for their president. Whether they're legal or not illegal, it, it's, the issue is not for today. Americans aren't, uh, aren't allowed to vote when they're overseas, overseas. What do you think of that? Well, they're allowed to vote. They just do it in an archaic manner, which is an absentee voting system. Whereas my understanding of the Brazilian system is it's state-of-the-art and secure, and they're required to show an ID to vote. In the, for our military, for example, they have to vote with the absentee ballot, and most of them go uncounted, which is, which is wrong. We have people fighting in other countries to protect the rights of others overseas to vote, but nobody's protecting their right. We need to do something like this that's technologically advanced and secure to ensure that our military personnel get their vote counted, just like the Brazilians are getting their vote counted today. We have a mass of, uh, an election coming up here in Massachusetts um, you know, itself. Do you think um, we're going to have a, a, as big as, as of a turnout as we have over here for the Brazilians? Oh, I hope so. I mean, if you take a look at this crowd, they're out the door, around the corner, and up the street, exercising their, their right to vote. It just goes to show you how much they value that. Americans should value their right to vote, because that's the only way you're going to make a change in a, in a system that is so upside down and that's destroying our economy. We are the, the greatest country on the planet with the strongest economy, and people need to get out there and make a change. If you don't like it, this is the way to do it, is you have to vote. You're watching BTN.